there's a switch. Let's just go for it. was just so entertaining to watch. CJ is going to go crazy watching it. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. Guess what? I want to show you something. I got a big, huge, giant. Ah! Wow. Are you ready? This is gonna be the biggest toilet paper roll tower tornado you've ever seen. You got it. All right, we gotta plug it in. Hold on. Adult supervision. <laughs> Ready? Now we're missing one roll, but guess what? I have the biggest toilet paper roll in the whole wide world. Do you want to see it? I'm going to put it on top and I'm going to put it on the fan. It's giant. It's huge. How big? Really, really big. Bigger than like two or five or ten of those. Can you see it? Let's go see it. What is it? Have it downstairs in a box. You ready to see just how big? Yeah. It's in here. Yeah. Open the box. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait. Whoa. So baby. Yeah. Are you ready to do it with that roll? Yeah. It's bigger than your face. <laughs> nice. Look how much bigger it is than a regular roll. Look at this. One thing I was concerned about was that CJ's fingers would get in there and potentially get hurt. 
So I tested it out with a crayon. Here, put your finger next to the crayon. Let me focus. Okay, so his finger is definitely shorter than the crayon and thicker than the crayon. So if the crayon is going to be fine, I know his finger will be fine. So the, the crayon can't even reach the fan when I put it as far down as possible. It doesn't even touch the blade from either side, from the bottom or from the top. So I know even if his finger would get in there, it couldn't get down far enough to hit the blade. But try to stick your finger in. Try to here. Try to stick it in here. It doesn't. Does it fit? Doesn't even fit in. Try again. It's off. It's okay. You could try it when it's off. It doesn't doesn't even fit in. So I know that no matter what happens, he is going to be totally fine. We're going to test it with the crayon actually now. Look, I'm going to put it on and see what happens if a crayon gets in there. It doesn't even hit the crayon. And again, the crayon is longer than his finger. So we are good to go. Woohoo! Yeah. Not like actually go, like I mean start. What was that? Oh, that was my camera. The air is sucking up really strongly from underneath and that's creating a giant suction area from under the fan and it's sucking all the paper that's falling from the air. As it falls down, it gets sucked up underneath and then it just blocks. The fan needs to be open for air to flow through so that it could flow out, but with all the toilet paper blocking, it's stopping it from shooting up. So you know what we're gonna do? It still somehow got sucked underneath the fan. How did it get there? I guess any little area. Actually, it's not so bad. It, it stopped. It, it, we need to block a little more. Let me show you where. That's right, put it in the mountain pile. Whoa. Yeah, it's big. What should we do with all that toilet paper? Now you can dump in it. Ooh, ooh, wait. Woohoo! Hi! <laughs> now I'll open it tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Get it. Give me a small <laughs> ah. Give me a small roll. Give, give me a small roll. Where's the small roll? Oh man. Help. Help. Now this definitely brings new meaning to toilet papering at house. <laughs> Usually when people toilet paper a house, they toilet paper the, the outside of a house. We did the inside of the house. I like the bathroom. Alright. Time to clean all of this up and we are gonna go outside. We will see you soon in our next video. We are over here. This is our outdoor test. Guys, here we go. Are you guys ready to see the most epic toilet paper launch of all time? GoPro's over there. We are outdoors. There is nothing stopping us besides the sky. CJ and his cousin, hi cousin, are right here. We are going to be launching this. Are you ready? Three, two, one.
So stay incredible. Peace out. Subscribe. What else? <laughs> and we'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Whoa. <laughs>